Get it out of there quickly. Little out pattern to Zachary Franklin, the senior from Dallas, Texas. Play fake, and he's going for it all there. Back shoulder throw, and it's caught by Bryant. Beautiful call off that play fake. What Josh talked about. This is a third and one situation in your own territory, and they're going to go up top to a guy who they said was really good last. Pat Bryant with the big catch. So they're inside the 40, and they go to the tight end, Tanner Arkin. Young man that's come a long way out of Fort Collins, Colorado. They do a great job in their opening plays, and you can see it on display right now. Again, getting around it quickly, a bust. It's open, it's Bryant, it's touchdown. That'll quiet this crowd. Fifth touchdown for Bryant. A different dude and was good last year. Watch the double move. He just Ooh. sticks his foot in the ground and goes vertical. He sails that he's going to go on the out route. Play fake. Well, he had his tight end, but he decided to tuck it and run. And he'll usher himself out with a first down. Fagan in the backfield. Play fake to him. And it's a slant by Zuccari Franklin on the receiving end. And he's out beyond the 35 to the 37. A leader in the NCAA. Yeah, nice job getting right behind the linebacker. You can see those safeties in line. Out of the shotgun again, Altmaier with all kinds of time. Now he lets it fly to his safety valve, Dixon, and Colin Dixon, but a go-to receiver here, manages the 40-yard line. That's just a yard shy of a first down. Altmaier's been living up to advanced billing as well. Right down the seam again for a first down. Zakari Franklin. Right across the middle, Colin Dixon as if on cue for the first down. That's a gain of 17. Here we go. Altmaier in traffic, decides to pull it down again and gets it to the 45. Now, this will be interesting because it's fourth and manageable now. Second and 10. Bootleg action again, and Altmaier dumps it underneath to the tight end, Tanner Arkin. There it goes. Oh, well conceived, but the pass just out of his outstretched arms. Quick out, and it's caught by Pat Bryant. He dropped one earlier between the one and the five, but not this time. Got man to man coverage, it looks like, from Nebraska. And they flush it out to the tight end, Arkin, and it is right there for him. Inside the five and down at the three. You talk about a well. Altmaier under center. In the corner, it's caught. It's touchdown, Tanner Arkin. Well, it was his drive, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. I, I, you just know you have to keep it in his hands, right? He's doing a very good job of distributing. As we used to call it, spider two, Y banana. Watch the tight end and his route. It looks like a, the shape of a banana. He goes and turns. It's not a real defined route. It's just the shape of a banana. Fake the power. We haven't seen this throughout the game. Illinois is having real success with the run game, and it's going to loosen up the pass. Oh, yeah. Yes. This is just a well-conceived offensive game plan by Barry Lunny, isn't it? That's Malik Elzey. Third and nine. They're giving safety help. Altmaier sees green grass and is very close to the five-yard line. He needed the four. Malik Elzey's got man coverage at the top of the screen. Altmaier to the tight end. Just in, just in. Big-time touchdown. That is Brandon Henderson. Henderson. Yes, Brandon Henderson, number 94, who came in for, guess who, Tanner Arkin. No, he's not known for that. He's more the blocking tight end. Carson Gota, the senior from Braden, that normally used in that capacity. How about the footwork? Do you see him Ooh, take that inside yeah. stem? Get Pressure right up the middle. Altmaier reads it. Quick out pattern for a first down. Fagan stays in the backfield, dotting the eye. Play fake for the corner. It's Bryant. It's touchdown. Barry Lunny's play calling tonight, Devin, has been extraordinary. And, and Altmaier has executed to perfection. Bryant into the flat as a fullback, right? Fake the power. He sneaks into the flat, avoids the defender, and he's wide open.